guys, what's up? Irish Emerald here, coach of your Waxer Waylords, and welcome to our week two matchup up against Root, coach of the New Jersey Brobats. Um, let me just quickly set up the game. Uh, if you guys haven't checked out Root, first and foremost, definitely go check him out. If you're into drafty content, he is the man to be following because he does so much of it. I don't know what the man's machine, I don't know how he's able to do it. But um, I'm just set up the game here, apologies now. Uh, as well, if I snuffle right here throughout this match, right? Or, I apologize, I'm a little bit under the weather. I got a runny nose slightly. So if I'm a little bit off, I am, I, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But I'll try not to be. Um, what else was I trying to say? Yeah, definitely go check him out. He's a really nice guy. But with that in mind though, screw Root. I want to beat him. I want to beat him so bad. He knocked us out of the playoffs last season. So screw him. And if he thinks some princess with a megastone is going to beat us, he's got another thing coming. I want to be able to smack him silly. But uh, he's got a very scary team. Uh, I will go through why his team is. Just give me a moment. I want to set up the game here. I'm gonna go with. Uh, you know, I'm gonna go with the ultra recon squad. Ultra recon squad music. Why not? Um, sorry, no. As I said, I'm a little bit under the weather, but that is not going to tear me today. Um, right, root squad. I will just briefly go. I'll briefly go through it quickly. He's got Garchomp, Scizor, Shaman, Incineroar, Configurus, Raichu, Mega Diancie, Milotic, Meloetta. Thurpuff and Swallow and a Ghost Z Crystal. That team is so scary. That Steel Fairy Dragon Core is ridiculous. Garchomp does so much to me. Mega Dancy does a lot. My lot can sit there and wall things for days. It's so bulky with the flame open and whatnot. Oh, it's such an annoying team. Slurpuff can be a bit of a nuisance too. But this is the team we're going to go with. Mega Beedrill, kind of very, very standard step, but it has Defog to get rid of hazards. We have a um, kind of a bit of a bulky Sylveon here. But enough to, uh, enough to be able to take hits from uh, Mega Diancy, uh, like th to be th not 2 a kill but 3 a kill but able to smack it back with a Hyper Voice. Choice Scarf, Darmanitan, uh, Choice Scarf, Hoopa, we need to be able to put pressure on this team so badly. Um, an AV Fisky defensive Rotom mode to deal, <laughs> to deal with his threats. And we have a D Dan Salamis as well. Uh, that's the squad. If you guys want more int intel on that, that sort of thing, check out the team building video, it'll be in the description down below. Uh, as well as all the other stuff for the UBL, like the Discord, the website we have, all that kind of fun stuff. So definitely go check that out. As um, yeah, I'm I'm petrified. First I was afraid, I was petrified, thinking I could never live without you by my side. Yeah, I'm, I'm sick and I'm delirious, but hopefully, hopefully we get the W today. I've been talking so much smack about winning this game. It's petrified. What is he doing, right you? <laughs> Okay, he's got Raichu. I was expecting Raichu. He's got Scizor. Alright, okay. Uh, he's got Swell. Okay, All right, Swell. Okay. He's got Swell. He's got Shaman. Um, Alright, I was. Um, I'm a bit shocked by some of these, but okay. I could have sworn he was going Garchomp because Scarf Garchomp did so much to me. Um, and I could have sworn he would have got Configurus for maybe some. For some Shenanigan enemy, but fair enough. It could be Sh uh, Scarf Shaman. We what, need to watch out for that. The Manitan does do damage to it, but we need to be very careful. And it's got Meloetta. Now, Meloetta is also a bit of a threat. Now, we have kind of prep for this. Um, my lead, no matter what, is Rotom, which I forgot to give a nickname to for this match. I'm sorry. Uh, and if you guys are wondering where the Wexler attire is, it is freezing in my room, and I'm sick. So <laughs> I know I've said I'm sick a few times, but I, honestly, I'm just being... I'm just being, just trying to get myself better. That's all I'm trying to do. Um, but yeah, Arlene, no matter what, is Rotom. Because if he leaves with Diancy, we want to be able to scare that thing out. Because at least Storm does oak code. I can both switch out. Potentially go into, uh, get enough chip damage chip damage on it. If he stays in, we can go out to Mega Beedrill. Do the job with that. Okay, so that's the kind of plan. Let's hope for the best. Let's hope for the best. He's got, he doesn't have Slurp off. So no shenanigans with that. Swallow, though, could be a bit scary. But we just have to wait and see. But anyways, good luck. Have fun, Root. And hopefully we do the job as I'm sorry now my audio is a bit off today. My audio is my audio program is decided it's just gonna just not behave, so I might have to I might have to fix it once or twice throughout the match. I just even minimize just in case. Okay, let's hope for the best. Let's hope for the best. Come on. We're gonna leave a rotom. Harvester, you're gonna do the job for me. As uh, Dion's. Alright, so we were kinda of knew this is gonna be a thing. I'm full switching here. Actually Yeah, we both switch here. We've all switched here. Now, if he's if, because if he goes for the hit or like, and we, we we should take it with the AV, and then we can probably pivot out into something else. As I was saying, Mega Beedrill. Um, if he switches, we get a bit of momentum, which would be very very nice. So we will go with that. Um, that's the kind of plan. 
No Garchomp. It's going to a draw. Okay, so we're immediately going to get um, some good momentum with Caitlyn, the Meloetta, the Shaman. Okay, I'm cool with that. I can get some info on the Shaman. I think we just go out into... I could go out into Darm here. A new turn. Um, let me just, I just want to make sure. You're going to see me doing a good few calcs here, guys. I am very, very afraid of... Uh, Roots team. I, you're going to see me being very careful about what I'm going to do here. So I apologize for anything like that that I'm going to do. A U turn will do about 50%. Would give me, well, what's the switching for Flurbit? Mega Diancy? I'm okay with that. I'm pretty sure I'm okay with that. So I think we go out into DK here and I just go Flare Blitz. I don't care if he goes. Yeah, if he goes on to Mega Diancy, I'm okay with that. I believe I'm okay with that. I could go U-turn. He isn't staying in here. He is not staying in here. He's switching. He's going to switch out with this into Meloetta or something. Swellow maybe. Right you. He could go on to Mega Diancy. Eat the Flare Blitz. Does he want to do that though? Parry records if we go Flare Blitz here, we do serious damage. Serious damage. But another part of my wreck is we should just go U-turn and be safe. I'm going to play very safe here. I'm just going to go U-turn. Yeah, he is going to withdraw. Who are you going to go out to, Sunshine? Deons. Okay, that's cool. I'm cool with that. I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. Let me just get a wee bit of chip on you. That's fine. Uh, right, let me just go out to my Rotom again. We're back to square one, but I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. And I think we... I'm just going to go... <laughs> I'm just going to go post switch again. I don't... I, I don't see the point in staying... I don't see the point in going for the Leaf Storm when he's got Shaman who could just sponge it. I'm just going to try and be careful. Keep momentum. Chip away him a bit. Tiancy, I just need to get a little bit more off. Any sort of chip on the ass is more than welcome. This thing is terrifying on my team. Yeah, there was no there was no point wasting um a flare blitz there and the answer was just gonna take it. We do need to be kinda a little bit more careful with our with our flare blitzes and, and such, so we, we are gonna be like that. Who does he go into here? Does he go into Shaman again? But every time we go into Shaman I go into Darm. So it, it's interesting. We got no info on the Shaman. Who is he going with here? I got my notes here beside me. I should actually look. Ooh, nah, I'm fine. I leave my notes here. <sighs> yeah, I think we. Yeah, both switch out. If we both switch out, we go on the Shaman. We're going to Donkey, uh, Donkey Kong or Dar Malatan. I think we just U turn again. Okay, he stays in. He stays in. Now, you did not Mega. He used to make a turn one. Oh oh. Oh no. Oh what has he done? What has he done? Oh no. I have to go into Sylveon here, but Um I don't know what's that how that's I don't know how that's gonna play out for the rest of the game. He, went, he goes to the Diamond Storm. We eat that. Um, interesting. He's got not... Well, I, I could go Wish here. I could go Wish here. Um, uh... Well, I'll just go with my don't f don't forget the mega rule, but I just remind them. Um, I don't think that probably has I don't think that has too much of a I don't think that'll change the game too much. So I think we'll just play on. Do, 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 do. I could hyper voice. Do I hyper voice here? Who's he got? What well, he's got? I gosh dingy darn. I think I wish. 
Well, I do have hidden power here. I do have a hidden power. I do have hidden power fire here. Um. I kind of want to just click Hyper Voice. Um, no, I'm going to go Wish. I think Wish is probably the safer play. As he is going to withdraw. Uh, Meloforia. The. Mel Meloa, okay. Interesting. Interesting, okay. Um, I'm kind of happy enough to go for. Let's see, hmm. I'm kind of happy enough just to go for a. Hyper voice here on this thing. Just to scout it a little bit. So you got U-turn. Alright, let me start chopping some of the stuff down here. You got Diamond Storm. Right. You U-turned here. You have to go into Scizor. Surely you go out into Scizor here. You no real other option. You go into Scizor. C the Scizor Sisters. Scizor. And... Oh god, I'm so nervous. Gotta try and <laughs> after losing the week one, I'm like, guys, we can't go back on a losing streak. We can't start off a losing streak. I think he goes out with Scizor here. He has to, I think. But he might be scared of the HP fire. Sanga. The Raichu. You are gonna get smacked here, son. I'm good with that damage. That's nice damage. I'm okay with that. Uh, I'm hyper voicing again here. As you got full switch. And your life orb. Okay. Uh, such a weird team. I don't know why he didn't bring more of his threats, to be honest. He probably knows he can beat me anytime. He's like, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take it easy against them <laughs> this week. Give him the, give him the easy W. Okay, we get some sort of chip on him, but of course that's not going to do very much. It's Scizor, for Christ's sake. Uh, I could have gone HP Fire, but... Nah. Right, okay. Nightwing is my uh, play here. I look at his team. I look at his team, I'm wondering, like... Do if I get to... Oh, no, I can't go to plus two here. Don't be, t don't, be t don't be taking nonsense, Irish. Uh, do not be taking nonsense like that. I'm just going to get the Timmy off. Is he going to go knock off? He's going to go your turn. Okay, well, that's going to do very little to us. Now, he might go into Deansa here, which, to be fair, is the play. It is the play. Right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's see why he's going to. I think he goes on to Deansa here. Scares me out with the Diamond Storm. I think that's the right play to do, as I need to fix my audio again. I apologize, folks. God almighty, just... As soon as it gets... One ball goes into the, into the software, folks, for your microphone. It all goes haywire. Um, I think he goes down to Deansi. Or is he going to... No, he goes down to Deansi, I think. He's after wrestling a good bit of momentum back. He's, got, he's ran an awful lot of switch initiative here. But I know... Well, I think Meduel is probably scarfed. Scizor, you never know. You never, never know. Uh, I'm curious. I'm cu definitely curious. So, yeah, he has brought the Swallow here and it's Guts. So, you are Guts. Um, Alright, okay, well, that means speed load speeds and all that kind of good stuff. I do need. Well, if he's facade, he's going to do buckets to anyone. Okay, let me think here, right? Good Swello. Does a lot of damage. Who do I need the most here? Deansi is after getting a bit of chip. So, Darmanitan and Scarf Hooper could do work and beat it. So, do I need. I probably need Sylveon from Meloetta and Shaman. And then I need, and the Nightwing should be able to deal with Scizor, and so can Darmanitan. Okay, I think Rodom is the most expendable mod here, but he's got himself in a very nice situation, I'm not going to lie. So we're going to bring in Rodom. I think Rodom is the switch. Now if he goes U-turn here again, I'd be going bonkers, but he is going to go for the facade, that's fair enough. 
And that does two shots. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I did not announce that can really switch into this thing. I have to go, I have to just sack it. As he's going to go U-turn. Okay, that'll give us a bit of momentum back. I'm okay with Rotom going down here. It sucks, but I have nothing that can take a hit off that Swellow. But I do, out, I do outrun it and speed it, so that's not too bad. Question is now, who does it go into? Um, Deance is at a really weak point now. Deance is going to come back in. You're at like 70-ish. How much does my Beedrill do? Uh, how much does my Beedrill do? Beedrill. Poison Jab. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, baby. How much does U-Turn do? 48%. I think U-Turn is probably the better player. I think we go into... Yeah, I think we go out into Beedrill and we just go U-Turn here. I need to rest. I could go for the kill, but I, he's probably going to go into Scizor or something. So I'm going to Mega Evolve and... Yeah, I think we just U-Turn. Just get a small bit more chip on this day and see. A small bit more chip. And we should be fine. We should be fine. Ooh, that's fine, that's fine. Right, let's see, we're going to Mega Evolve here. He should switch or Mega Evolve himself. He's going to Mega Evolve himself. Okay, that's cool. We could have got rid of that DNC. Oh, that would have been awesome. But we, I, we need, we can't play too aggressively against this thing though. That's a huge chunk of damage. I'm very, very happy with that damage. I will not lie. He's probably going to go Diamond Storm. If you're going to go Diamond Storm. If you're going to go Diamond Storm, I think Sylveon. Do I get rid of Sylveon this early? I don't think I can. I don't think I can. My, okay, who do, I need Sylveon to wall Metal Weather and Shaman just in case. Hoopa? Do I need, I think, I don't think Hoopa is, is as needed as, or is, it, or is Mint not needed. I think we, I think we'll chance, if I bring in Hoopa here, if I bring in Hoopa here, Let's think here. If I bring in Hoopa, then if he goes for the Psychic or the Earth Power or something like that, then we're fine. But if he goes Diamond Storm, we're dead. I need Sylveon healthy to do a shame in the middle with it. Um, I think, I really do think that Darmanitan does more work here. And if, yeah, I really do think so. Raichu be worn down. Darmanitan be Scizor, Shaman. Yeah, I think we have to. I think we have to. If I'm being honest, I think we have to go out into a Hoopa here. So we're going to do that. God. Mm. Rock Polish. Okay. Okay, that was. I right, um, That is scary. But you don't Oko. I just got. You don't. Be, you, I don't. Like, Diamond Storm Oko's me, but you don't want me one by Sylveon. I can just hyper voice you and kill you. So I'm going to go for the. I could go knock off, but I think energy boss pro so, shock probably kills actually from here. Now that I think about it. Now that I think about it, so I think we might just take a look. Side shock does, yeah, side shock kills from here. And she has to go. Diamond Storm is only a roll here, by the way, folks. Well, it's a roll in its favor. It's fifty percent, fifty-fifty chance. Ah, oh, come on, give me that look. Moonblast, can we eat one? No, we don't. Oh, sorry, we, I didn't. Okay, so we're two, we're two nil down. Come on, Sylvia, you can definitely do work here for me. He's oh, as soon as he got momentum, he's been on fire. Um, I'm going to take hyper voice here. I'm going to take Kyber Voice here. He's going. Mm. 
Deontay, why are you such an issue? I'm actually very happy that if we can get rid of this thing, I'm actually fairly confident that we can do a bit more work. I have to click no, I have to click hyper voice. I can't play mind games. He's got plus two speed. If I don't click hyper voice here, he will he what he, he runs over me. I have to click hyper voice. If he if, if he could bring his or predicting the hyper voice, I'm going to, I have to go hyper voice. If he could bring he could sack the right which I wouldn't mind. But I think he's I think he clicks Diamond Storm here. Did I why did I why did Moonblast not pop up? Oh yeah, Moonblast did pop up Irish. You just didn't look at it because you're blind and ignorant and a fool. Yeah, Moonblast is always gonna kill me there. Okay. I think we go hyper voice. I hate he's trying to call does Diamond Storm do enough here? Live this. You do I know I live this. Unless it's a crit, we live this. Thank you very much. Down goes this Deance. Beautiful. Okay, that, that works for me. That works majorly for me. Guys, I'm sorry if my mic keeps speaking up. I don't know what's going on with my audio settings, but it just keeps bringing the mic up to 100 percent Jessica's gonna come in. The sweat up. Okay. I need this thing. I need Sylveon. I constantly kept saying I need Sylveon. I need Sylveon. Do I bring a Nightwing here? See, we're now at the point where that mountain can kind of come in at any point, click Fair Blitz and nuke something. Which is great. Which is great. But I need to be very careful at the same time. I need to keep my team very healthy. This Swellow is a big, big problem. Okay. I think if we intimidate it, we'll be in good shape. I think if we intimidate and we bring up each we go for knockoff, we'd be in good shape. I think we, yeah, I think we have to do that. I think we bring out, yeah, I think we bring, I think we bring up men to intimidate it. Yeah, I think I need Sylveon, I need Darmanitan, I need Beedrill. For me, anyways, that's what I need on my left to win this game. Because they outspeed and outrun his whole team. That's sad. Now, Guts is still... He's still going to do a good bit to me. Yeah, he is, yeah. God damn Guts. Um, on the off chance he decides to save this thing, I'm going to go for the... I could go D-Dance here, but just on the off... On the off chance he's, he decides to save this thing. But, I, yeah, I think we'll go... But he might think we're scarfed here. Yeah, I think, ooh, I think we go D-Dance. Just in case he thinks we're scarfed. Just in case he thinks we're scarfed. That would be nuts if he thought so. Absolutely bonkers. That would work very well in our favour, to be fair. That would work very, very well. I think that's what he's thinking. He's trying to figure out, am I scarfed here? Well, he could bring out Scizor if he, if he is scarfed. You can go U turn out with Scizor. Yeah, I think, I think that's what it does. I think that's what it does, if I'm being honest. This and the Swallow. What, the Ancy and the Swallow, they are the two things. If I can get rid of those two, Meloetta, Shaman, yeah. Scizor would be an issue, but I think we'd have enough if Darm is still in the back to deal with it. And we have Wish on Sylveon to kind of hopefully do damage. Yeah, he, yeah okay, he goes for it. Cool. So Mens goes down. Okay. Right. Um, we go out to Beedrill. We go out to Beedrill and... I'm pretty sure we just go... We literally just go... Knock off here and we should be fine. Mm, no, not quite. <laughs> not quite. I wish I could go knock off, but I can't. I have to go. I need a bit more chip on him. I need to go for a poison jab. So that's what we do. As the wave. 
That's all. Okay, cool. Probably could have gone U-turn there, expecting that. Let's U-turn. We U-turn here. Go out into. Damn. Well, he could U-turn. Ooh, that does nice damage. Um, he could U-turn himself here, but Damn should be able to eat it. Damn, I'm going to need you to pull like serious stuff out here for me. Yeah, he is going to U-turn himself. Who are you going to U-turn out into, boy? Who are you going to U-turn out into? I want to swallow. So that'd be lovely. <laughs> I won't lie, that would be awesome. Probably U-turns out into Raichu, I'd say. I think you, we have to wait and see why it goes for here. If he goes out into either Shaman or Metaweather, I think we U-turn. If he goes out into this thing. I really do not have a problem U-turn here. You're going to get information that I'm scarfed, but I have no problem giving you that at this point in the game. As you got E speed, okay. That does a healthy chunk. To me. Okay, cool. So right here goes down to Darm. Well, he actually doesn't know if I'm scarfed yet or not. I'm going to go to Bijou. Bijou is probably my. Yeah, Bijou is, is, is the play for me at this moment in time. Now, if he goes down to Meloetta, we have to go out to Sylveon immediately. Because he'd probably be scarfed and he'd just go. He'd go for the for the, the fun the fun stuff. He'd go for the fun stuff with the psychic and whatnot. So we gotta go out into B. He's gonna go out into his matter about it. So we have to go out into Beedrill here. Well it's not Beedrill, we have to go out into Sylveon here. We just got it. We just got it. Right, let's see what he's got in his bag of tricks. Psy Shock. How much are you going to do to me here? Yeah, you want to do enough. How much was that going to do to me anyways? Hold on, let me just make sure. It's your choice specs against my Sylveon. My Sylveon set. Let me scroll down. How much were you going to do? Psy Shock. We were very low now, to be fair, so the, that was probably within range. 39% sight, so, yeah, doesn't matter. Yes, yeah, so, we don't get any information there from that. I have to go into, um, I have to go into Darm. I have to go into Darm. Yeah, I have to go into Darm. Um, I could go U-turn. I could go U-turn. Well, if this is his choice mod, if this is his choice mod, then I think I click Flare Blitz. And then, Scizor's low. We're playing with fate here, but I think we click Flare Blitz and we just gotta, we gotta hope for the best with, um, he's gonna withdraw. Who are you gonna go home to? Caitlyn. Okay, well you're, you should be dead. I need, I need you to live this recoil now, damn. That was probably a really good play. That was a really good play by Root, to be fair. Live the recoil, please. Yes! Thank you. Right, I need to preserve you. Pretty sure I need to preserve you. Well, it depends, actually. If he goes that... Ooh. Well, no, to be fair, I need him from Metalweather. I need him from Metalweather. Um... Who's going into here, though? Swellow. Swellow gets a kill anyways here. Actually, no, he's not, because I just go. If he's Scarf Metalweather, he should go out with the Swallow here. Why? Why did you have to think about that, bud? That's interesting. Why did you have to think about that? You should. If you're Scarfed, you should have just walked into. You should just. If you're Scarf Metalweather, you should have just walked into that matchup. 
Interesting, interesting. We're gonna bring out B here, but but BP. How much is that gonna do? Yo, bandits. Yeah, he's bandits. Yo, bandits. And that's game. And that's game. That is game. So he's gonna go for the BP. Ah, man, that sucks. That sucks for us. <sighs> man, oh. To be fair, his team wrecked mine. It really wrecked mine. But I wasn't expecting right to. I wasn't expecting the swallow, really. So it was, it, to be fair, that was kind of... Like, I was expecting some other stuff, like Slurpuff and a couple of other things. But I really wasn't expecting that. Oh, man. We've never started 0-2. Oh, GG though. GG the root. Good game, bud. Good game. Oh, man. Oh, he's dying for that win, but his team was very good. Oh, we never started 0 2. Oh, my God. We've a work cut out of us if we want to make playoffs this season. Absolute work cut out, of us. cut out for us. Oh, my God. Look, that's the way the cookie crumbles sometimes, unfortunately. We just got to. But was back next week. Oh, damn it. There was a couple of times I was too passive in that game. Way too passive. I should be a bit more aggressive. I'm going to... Yeah. Yeah, I thought we started very well, but... His facade, Swello, wrecked me. I need, I, need, I should have prepped for that a bit more. But it looked at it. It, looked, it is what it is. It is what it is, folks. I can't uh, control all that. Um... Right, I am going to wrap it up here today. And guys, if this video is a little bit lacking in quality, I apologize. My, for some reason, software was all over the place. And um, if the webcam didn't work correctly, it's because I'm still working around with new stuff for the, for the settings for you guys. So I apologize for that. And again, I apologize for the sniffles in the background. But yeah, definitely go check out Roos' channel. As, oh my God, Mike, you're killing me. Definitely go check out Roos' channel. Link to him and all the other courses in the description down below. Check out the UBL content as well, like the website and all that, and the Discord server, all that kind of good stuff. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please click the like button down below for me. If you guys got any comments on today's battle, going to be good, but definitely let me know in the comment section down below. And last but not least, if you want to see more UBL action coming away on this channel or more content in general, please smash that subscribe button down below for me and click that bell icon. And I know I'm going to get out of here. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you next time.